Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and Mubarak Ramadan to all my Muslim brothers and sisters. And as we all know, this is a holy month of Ramadan and the Muslims are praying and fasting in this month. I have decided to join in. I joined in last year. I fasted and prayed the whole month and I've decided to do it again this year and I am going to do daily videos but of course it's not going to be daily I'm going to do the videos uh, when I get the chance and when I have time and take you along guys with me in this journey and yeah so this is my third day of fasting I started on Tuesday at the beginning of Ramadan everything went well on my first day I cannot complain I didn't have any like headaches that kind of a thing but yesterday which was my second day I had a slight headache in the morning but as the day progresses so was the headache and it was just unbearable around 3 p.m. so I decided to break my fast by just taking the paracetamol and water because it was just unbearable i didn't eat anything after that but around six o'clock which was the time of breaking the fast i took um date and the fresh laban so the fresh laban for those who don't know this is the fresh laban it is more like um in Komazi in south africa no 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 not in Komazi because in Komazi has got this um sour taste this is more like your buttermilk but i don't know if some people they know what is buttermilk especially my 2000 <laughs> because i don't see buttermilk anymore in the shop so this is more like your buttermilk and this is the date so when people break the fast they drink the fresh laban and they take the date okay the date is from inside this bag this is the date but it is very sticky so i use a spoon to scoop out just one date so the date is the fruit from the palm trees as we know that this country is full of palm trees and this is the fruit from the palm tree i didn't like dates before when i just came here because i think i was introduced to the not so nice dates because they are different i didn't know before so for so many years that i was in this country i didn't eat dates because i didn't like dates because i was exposed to the wrong date but now i am so in love with the dates they are very nutritious and they are very sweet as well so people who are avoiding the sugar they use date because the date is very healthy and nutritious even people here what they do they drink tea without sugar but they use the date as a camouflage for sugar so yeah so this is what i eat they say that when you are in rome you do as the romans do so i eat date with my fresh laban but of course after eating this uh when i break my fast I don't feel hungry anymore so what i do i go to the gym then i will eat when i come back around 10. so i have been fasting the whole day today as you can see i'm very tired i'm a wreck i was at work the whole day without eating anything without drinking anything the last time i ate was um last night when i came back from the gym which was after 10 o'clock I haven't eaten until now now I have just prayed I'm about to break my fast so I'm going to eat date and my fresh laban so yeah guys I hope I'm gonna be able to continue with the fasting I hope and pray that I'm going to be able to continue with my fasting until the last day of Ramadan and yeah I hope I don't fall along the way so i will take you guys with me throughout this journey and see how i go about with my daily fasting so what happens to the rest of the people who are not fasting they are not supposed to be eating anything in the presence of 
the fasting people so don't let anyone who is fasting see you eating so if it is lunch break you have to be in the corner or somewhere where nobody is going to see you that you are eating you're not allowed to drink anything in public spaces i mean even if you are in the street and you are thirsty you're not allowed to eat anything even if you're in the mall you're not allowed to eat anything in the corridors don't eat and don't drink anything and don't chew a gum yeah that's another offense don't chew a gum don't give another person an impression that you are eating anything that's temptation fighting temptation <laughs> that's temptation so don't do it and yeah as difficult as it is i just remember when i was new here and um we went to send money home so there was just this one bank so when we got there it was very hot and the bank was closed it was prayer so we had to wait outside until the prayer is finished so there was a vending machine in the same street so i decided i want to buy pepsi there so i put my one real as i was about to buy the pepsi the pepsi came out and it was nice and cold and as i was about to open it it was very hot outside this lady that i was with she was here before me so she jumped and told me no don't open that pepsi and we were in the street there was nobody around us it was just us people who came to remit the money i think it was just uh, four of us we were a group just going together just to remit money but because you don't know if the police will just drive pass by and if they see you drinking it's an offense you know so i just took my pepsi i put it in my bag and i couldn't drink anything until i got home so that's how serious it is you don't drink you don't do anything so yeah i'll show you the rest of what is going on with me with my fasting and what's happening in the country during the fasting month of ramadan and this video is just meant to maybe educate a few people who are like me who didn't know anything about the ramadan and fasting it's just only when i got in this country that i i got to know because unfortunately even when i was in south africa i wasn't close to anyone who was a muslim so a lot of things about ramadan and fasting um, fasting of course I know because I'm a Christian so I do fast but fasting as in Ramadan fasting I only get that exposure when I got into this country so part of these videos that I'm going to make it is more educational just to show some people out there uh, who do not know what is going on in this country during Ramadan just for them to learn a little bit if there is anything that they can get from the video yeah that is all thank you so much for watching guys and i hope to see you in the next video tomorrow thank you bye please don't forget to subscribe tell your friends to subscribe and to tell their friends to subscribe